In this example, we are going to be finding the nth term value for a geometric sequence. And this is within the Delta Math online system, their arithmetic and geometric sequences problems. So here's our sequence, 14, 84, 504. So let's find the sixth term. So our n value is 6. We're going to use this formula, g of n equals g sub 1 times r to the n minus 1 power. So g sub 1 is the first term. So G1 is 14 in this example. R is our common ratio. So what is our common ratio? We go 504 divided by 84, you, you get 6. Take 84 divided by 14, you get 6. So please understand that the R value, the common ratio is 6 over 1. It's not the sixth term, though. Don't, don't get confused with that. It's, it's because it's 504 divided by 84 is 6. 84 divided by 14 is 6. There's our common ratio. So now we can go ahead and find this. G of 6 equals 14. There's our initial value. Multiplied by 6 raised to the 6 minus 1 power. Because n is n, the n term is 6 as well in this problem. So that's going to be to the fifth. So G of 6 equals 14 multiplied by... 6 to the 5th power. So the first thing I have to do is go 6 to the 5th power. So let me calculate that. So using the calculator, 6 to the 5th power becomes 7,776. And remember, that's 6 times 6 times 6 times 6 times 6. All right, so following the order of operations, we do the exponents first. So now it's going to be 14 times 7,776. So we get g of 6 equals a large number. On the calculator, it's 108,864. So now we'll check within the Delta Math system and see if we are correct. So 108,864. And submit. And we get the check mark.